Salutations, fellow lizards. Welcome back to another episode of uh, Lizard Unite on the Lich's channel. I am Z Life, you are the Lich. And uh, I told you before how we do a lot of gaming and stuff together as a couple and we're friends and that kind of thing. Well, it is September the 6th, Friday, and it is D&D night. So uh, we made chili for everyone and uh, Amanda made some amazing macarons. Um, and she made some chocolate cup strawberries as well. So we kind of pitch in and cook together and game and have fun and everything together. But he's out there playing D&D right now. Uh, a lot of times I spend that time hanging out with Amanda. We go shopping or um, watch TV, watch YouTube videos, or uh, edit videos. And I wanted to get this one put out for tomorrow because tomorrow is Day of Dragons. Oh, dragons. I hope you know that about me. Um, I'm going to go for some information that I've uh, found out, some of it um, I learned in the Discord groups and then other information on from Lucky Builder, who's uh, Wizards News, and then there's the Orange Wizard, I think you can find him on Instagram, he has a lot of information as well, so those are some other really good sources. Um, anyway, I found, um, uh, today I found Angel's Trumpet flower on the ground, um, I was picking up stuff and such. Anyway, we have a new potion that's available. We'll go over that on the video. I'll probably put them in the corner of the information and stuff you can see on the screen. There is a free gift that you can get right now. It's 10 scrolls, uh, 25 energy, and then five red books. And I know there are a lot of people, my husband included, that are just, they cannot seem to get enough of the red books. So that's exciting news. So for America, we got the Peruvian faculty, super excited, and it's our secondary one, uh, the one that we were awarded because of all the court keys, or the, the majority of court keys that were opened during the event, is the Chinese Fireball. So we'll have those two dragons available. Uh, I suggest highly that you make sure you fill your index, that you're going to want to catch more in addition to that, especially if like you're, you're like me and you want to gain XP, make sure Anytime we have a new event coming, you always have a Dorothea's um, brain elixir. I always have tons of those in my inventory. Uh, but have them going, and you can continue to catch them even if you don't really need them for your, you know what I mean, to fill their slot. Um, you'll have a lot of XP in that, so you'll, you'll want to continue to catch them in your dragons. So I'm super excited. Uh, anyway, that'll be from 11 a.m. to 2 p.m. Pacific Standard Time uh, starting tomorrow. Uh, we have a bunch of other things that started earlier this week that are going on, and I believe they're going on through the 9th of September. We have a 25 XP bonus. Uh, the half the potion this time is cut in half on all potions. Then the port keys are also the distance walks, travels, whatever you want to call it, is, is cut in half as well. And uh, two times the amount of time on dark detectors. So that will all be going on through the 9th. There are new foundables in the nine and three quarters category going on right now. There's Godric Gryffindor, Helga Hufflepuff, Salazar Slytherin, and Rowena Ravenclaw. In addition to um, the fortress battles, you'll be able to catch the wild boar. So um, there are more fun and interesting things. I'm glad that they keep freshening it and keeping uh, going. Uh, as you know, we, um, Matt and I are both uh, Pokemon players as well, and there were times that things just stayed the same for a long period of time, and then it made stuff get stale or we didn't want to play. Like now, I mainly play for the Shinies. I do the daily events and the weekly challenges and stuff like that. I'm still trying to catch a Wizmar. I need one more. So, Lucky Builder from uh, Wizards News, as I mentioned before, he's a really good source. He mentioned what he does is they, they drive around in a group, and we do the same thing while we're playing. Although there's something we do a little different, and I commented on his uh, to, just to give him a suggestion because it's what we always do with Pokemon, is uh, the husband will be driving our SUV and I sit in the passenger seat, so I'm riding shotgun, and then we load up the rest of the, the SUV with a bunch of friends and everything we play. But while he's driving, I usually have, um, sometimes I'll turn and use the center console piece or I'll have a little laptop folder thing tray from my lap, and I man both of our phones at the same time. So that's something that if someone's going to sacrifice that they can't play as well because they're driving, then shotgun should be trying to man two phones. It's a little more difficult, I found, with Rosie Unite, especially when you get some one of the, um, the oddities. Like say you're trying to get the, um, the leprechaun or whatever, which I know he's an easy one to do, but you know where you have to do the traces and you have to hold it on the circle at the time and then you know protect yourself, even the vampire and all those, the werewolf and such. Those oddities, it makes it a little more difficult because you're having to keep up with it. But what I try to do with that is I don't start them both at the same exact time. I'll engage one 
and like I'll like I'll engage mine and get it sitting there and then go ahead and start on well, wait a second and, or do his and then try not to do it the same that time that makes it a little easier to keep up because then you're protecting on one while you're trying to attack on the other. So you just have to time it just right on that. But that, that way is a little more difficult. But the other one is a piece of cake to try to do them both at the same time. So because then you're, you'll hit the, um, the ends and then you'll scroll through the energy and then close them both out. So anyway, but it's like I said, if someone is taking the time to drive for you and their sacrifice playing the game, then I feel like it's only right for the person that you shot them to win up and, and apply for them. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and we would love to hear from you any comments or suggestions that you have. I just wanted to get this uh, information set up to you guys as quickly as possible since the Day of the Dragons is tomorrow, Saturday, super excited. Uh, I'm going to go hang out with friends and then to talk along and my amazing chili recipe. And I hope you have a wonderful, fun, and safe weekend. Have a good day.